Hey Tribe, Donna here from Transformational Healing and today is going to be a short video on how to properly burn Vesta powder. So many people will use Vesta powder to clear the energy of a space. There are other uses for Vesta powder, but that's what we're going to cover today. So you need to have a cauldron, a safe place to burn the Vesta powder, perhaps a small spoon so that you are not touching the Vesta powder yourself with your hands, and a long lighter. The most important part of that is your intention. So if you need to go watch the intention video to properly phrase that, make sure you check that out over here. But let's get started on showing you how to properly use Vesta powder to clear out the energy of your space. So this is Vesta powder. And it's a very soft and fine powder, but as moisture gets to it, it can begin to dry out and actually get into large clumps. I actually smushed quite a few of these clumps because some of the humidity had gotten to my bag because I didn't have it in a jar, and I will be changing that shortly. But like I said, you need a cauldron, a spoon, your Vesta powder, and a long lighter. And then just your intention. All you need to clear a room is your intention to clear the space, a little bit of Vesta powder. That's a baby spoon. So I always tell people a pea size amount of Vesta powder. I'm going to show you that in the cauldron as well. Just a very small amount in that cauldron. That's a three inch cauldron, so it's about the amount of a pea, maybe a little bit more. Be sure that your area is not flammable. Be sure that nothing in your area is flammable at all. Put your intention in your mind very strongly think that all negative energies all unwanted energies are going to leave this space repeat whatever you need to do to phrase that intention properly in your mind and then simply light it with a safe long match or a long lighter and then you touch it to the flame making sure nothing around that can go with your intention. There you go. And that smoke clears any negativity from the space. It clears everything that you need to have gone from the space. Because Mine is a little clumpy. It's not doing it all at once. When you use the loose powder, it literally can just go poof, one big poof. I'm also in a space that is very clear. You also want to make sure that because it has saltpeter in it, that it has burned all the way across or that nothing else is going to burn when you move it into a different space. So that was the short simple and sweet way to learn how to use Vesta powder. Just be sure that you're doing it in a fireproof environment. I have had people tell me, well, I put it in the middle of my bed because the bed was in the middle of my room. No, I don't care if you have it on a huge tray and everything's fireproof. Do not put it on the middle of your bed. Do not put it unless you have a very large space around it. Do not put it on a rug. Keep it up on a table, keep it safe, bring a small table and put a table in the middle of the room to clear the room. The intention is that when the Vesta powder is fresh, when it is powder, it literally just goes poof. And you saw all the fizzles and it just kind of spreads throughout, clears the smoke and clears the area. Well, now we have a clean room. So you're going to have to watch for my how to burn powdered incense video coming up in the next week or so to learn what you do after you've cleared the space because now we have 
an empty space. So we need to fill it with our positive energy. So I've had many videos about how to cleanse and clear a space and then also to fill it back up with love. I'm sure you can find lots of those on the channel, but I'm actually going to show you how to burn the powdered incenses that I have in the shop that are self-igniting. And that will be coming up next week. When it's ready, I will be sure to link it after this video, but make sure that you get that intention all set and make sure that you know how to properly do other things like how to use black salt to protect your space after you fill it back up with love. Many blessings tribe and I'll see you real soon.